so hey guys um i just um sorry i didn't make a video i got this clutch that came in on monday i was gonna make a video like of installing it and everything but the camera was out of battery so i couldn't yeah so it came in on monday and it's wednesday now and so yeah there's the pieces of the old clutch right here it was really hard to get off because it was all corroded on there it had been sitting for a while yeah, once I got that off, I just got the clutch on and tightened that up, and it's nice and tight. And then, um, cut the chain down to size, had to grind, a, grind the links off, it was four feet of chain. So we grind a couple links off over at the bench grinder there. Sorry, my garage is kind of a mess. We, we just, uh, did a fence for a neighbor. And then, that's nice, that's, I mean, it's pretty tight on there. There's a little bit of play, but it's good, it's not too tight. And... Took this thing out for a test ride, and this, it really goes. The five horse, I mean, like, once the clutch fully engages, it just, like, takes off. And I, I, like, I just floored it coming around. I was just driving around in my patio, and I came around a turn, and I just floored it, and the thing did a burnout. So, yeah, it's got lots of power. And then, so, yeah, here's the, I just grinded up a couple links here. So, and then, yeah, it's links just on the bench grinder, which is, like, perfect for doing that. And I had to, um, this little, it's like a little fuel bowl or something. I don't know, it used to, um, if you can see here, used to go right in there to like, it came in, uh, I can't really put it in there, but it used to be like right in there, sitting like that. But I don't know what happened to it, maybe like being dried out or something, like, um, kind of shrunk it because it had just fallen out. It was just like sitting on the ground next to the cart. And so, if like when you open the fuel valve, it would like all the fuel would come out of there because this is just supposed to be like a bowl for like settling dirt. And so, I asked my dad if, um, if he knew what to do. So, he had tried to like, he tried to heat it up with a torch, as you can see, and kind of like shove a wedge in there to try to expand it, but that didn't really work. And so, what he got is he got a nickel and a washer which fit perfectly in there and then tighten this thing up and so it's a nice seal the washer really seals it in and the nickel and so yeah it's it's sealed and it's off right now but like I was driving around like that and no fuel was really leaking out I've, I still have yet to get a fuel thing and then I need to um, hook the little the breather tube up to there it goes right there but yeah that works pretty well and it really goes the steering isn't too well it doesn't have too good of a steering radius. But yeah, I mean, it's really good in that, in that drum brake. It's like, it really has a lot of stopping power. Like, I mean, just a little bit of braking will, like, will just, um, you know, it'll, like, skid and stuff. Yeah, um, so that's just the progress update. And, um, so we're about to be off on spring break next week. So hopefully I'll be, like, I'm going to set... Since I got to run and I'm going to hang out with some friends, we're going to ride it around the parking lot or something. Because we know some good spaces to ride. But I can really get it all out. So yeah, I'll make a video then. And yeah, so hopefully that'll be up next week. So yeah, just another update. See ya.